Hundreds of people watch as music plays. Weeks of training and hard work is recognised. A new generation of naval leaders join the ranks of the Royal Navy at Britannia Royal Naval College. This passing out parade is the first in 12 months since family and friends have been invited. It's a precious moment for all. We've got uh, Grandad, uh, who's uh, X Signals like back well, in the day, and then uh, got uh, girlfriend. Favorite. Yeah, <laughs> we got girlfriend Philippa as well, who's come down. So lucky to have them both here. Yeah. How special is it for you? Um, it's it's awesome, especially going through. Uh, we were told like not to expect friends or family coming uh, to pass out. So to actually have them is a huge bonus. Given that with COVID, like the last few entries haven't had that opportunity. Yeah. <laughs> and so, Grandad, how how are you feeling today? Proud. Yes, I'm proud with them. <laughs> Keeping on the family tradition. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just so happy to be here because I did not expect that because of everything that's happened so far that we would actually be standing here today. So, and I'm very proud of you yeah, getting through it all. And yeah, yeah it's all right. <laughs> very, very happy. <laughs> Proud is certainly the word of the day. Many loved ones have travelled a great distance to watch the parade and reunite with loved ones. It's been uh, tough at times, but you've always got phone calls, FaceTime, stuff like that to try and stay uh, in contact. But yeah, it's been tough, but all worth it now. It's done. So. It's something we didn't think that was going to happen. We thought we'd be watching it on screen today, um, but we're really pleased to be here. Yeah. And Jacob, how do you feel? Like you said, we've had phone calls and everything, but obviously nothing really beats being in person. It's kind of just a different atmosphere, and it's a great feeling to see him finally. Because so. how long has it been since you've seen him? Um, uh, uh, March? I would say March, yeah, is the yeah. earliest we saw him, so it was a long time yeah, before, so. but we're here now, which <laughs> is the main thing. <laughs> It's been an unusual year for the college navigating through the pandemic, and it's meant those passing out today have had a very unique experience. Yeah, it's definitely been difficult. I think one of the hardest things was obviously we haven't really left the wire that much, um, but it has meant that the opportunities that we have had, so IST, for example, the initial sea time, have been even more kind of appreciated by the officer cadets for having not had that time outside. Um, and I think, so the way it worked, we came in January and then had an initial break where we all got sent back home and then a smaller number of us came back at the start of May, uh, March. Um, so we were a much smaller intake than we usually are. And that's actually been really good for us because we have made really great bonds between both divisions that came back. We know each other really well, we're all super close. So it'll be really hard leaving Dartmouth, but I think it's almost been better slightly weirdly because of COVID um, or for everyone that passes through Dartmouth kind of the pass out parade is like the pinnacle of achievement you know you finally made it and so to have the people that you care about most coming and being able to see it it means a huge deal it makes it much more much more special and it's sort of you stand a bit taller knowing that they're going to be there as well. Over the course of the pandemic, the pass out parades have been live streamed so people can watch online. Even though guests are now able to attend once more, this will continue so many more friends and family can enjoy the experience and be involved in a hugely significant moment. This is a historic day for the officer cadets. It's their day to pass out Britannia Royal Naval College after 29 weeks of quite intense training and, and made challenging during the COVID pandemic. But what it means to have the families here is uh, amazing. As you can tell in my voice, I'm almost getting emotional that they're coming because it's so important in the Royal Navy to have the families brought into our service. We often say the phrase, you recruit a sailor, but you retain the family. And that's how important they are for uh, HMS Rally, Commander Training Centre, Limson, and indeed here at Britannia Royal Naval College. And it's about uh, sharing uh, this organisation, this institution, this service that their loved ones have joined to, uh, to ensure they understand the, the challenges ahead. And it's their support, which is often our sort of asymmetric advantage, I like to phrase it, which is really important to our, our officers, our sailors, our whole force as we continue to deploy in operations. An emotional day. Oh, 
As families gather and celebrate, it's hoped these scenes will be able to continue at future parades. Bryony Williams, Forces News, Britannia Royal Naval College, Dartmouth.